Hello and welcome to another set of readings from Lotus Love Tarot 555. All right, you guys, we have a new moon in Scorpio that will take place on October 27th, 2019. This is going to be a very life-changing new moon, okay? This new moon is in Scorpio. And we know that Scorpio is about change. It's about um, secret, it's being secret. Um, about what you're doing. Um, Scorpios deal with um, a lot of emotions. And so this change is going to be for you, for you looking at areas in your life that need to be revamped, um, need to be looked at, need to, pos need to be uh, positioned so you can be in the right space, mind space, and um, so you can be in the right um, environment space for some of you, because some of you may even need to do a major change of moving. But this is the time to look towards change, looking towards changing um, your mind, your spirit, your soul, that is going to bring you the highest good for your life, okay? All right, so for some of you, I know I get this question all the time, especially by this, uh, the death card representing uh, Scorpio and Tarot. You know, is this going to be a painful time? Yes, for some of you, it may be a painful time because what the universe has been trying to shake out of you, um, you are still trying to hold on to it. So this might be a very abrupt change, <laughs> but it's going to be for your highest good. So the best thing we can do is to surrender to those areas in our lives that we know are not serving our highest good and to surrender to this change, surrender to this energy that's going to be coming forth from the Scorpio new moon, okay? All right, so just a little information about the reading. You can apply this to your sun, your moon, your rising, and for some, even your Venus sign. Hello to our cross watches up over there and uh, or out there. <laughs> um, don't forget to follow us on Instagram at Lotus Love Tarot 555. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Hit that little bell and every time we release a reading, you will be notified. Um, as far as the reading, I have already pre-shuffled so we can move quickly through that. Um, we're hoping to apply this to the new moon, but the energies, sometimes they're timeless. So it could have happened three months ago, could happen today, it could happen in the near future, okay? All right, I think I've covered everything. So just as a reminder, take the energy of this new moon, begin to do the changes that's needed so your life can be all that you want it to be. Now, on to your reading. Hello, my Leos. Okay, let's get right into your reading, you guys. And remember that this um, reading is for you to get an idea of where you need to set your intentions for the new moon, okay? This is not a full reading. It's just to give you an idea where you need to set your intentions, and that can be found on our new moon playlist on uh, the little video on how to set your intentions if you don't know. All right, let's get right into it. Holy Spirit, Divine Creator, the universe, what messages need to go for? For the sign of Leo, as they begin to set their intentions for the new moon occurring on October 27, 2019. What messages need to go for for the sign of uh, Leo? Okay. Yeah. Spirit of mind created the universe. What messages need to go for for the sign of Leo? They begin to set their intentions. Carrying on. October 27th, 2019. Okay, we got three here. Spirit, divine, creator, the universe. What message can go for for the sign of Leo? As we begin to set their intentions on the new moon occurring on October 27th, 2019. What message is they go for? Okay, Leos, we got a lot of messages being channeled for you. Holy Spirit, Divine Creator of the Universe. The best just need to go for for the sign of Leo. Let's begin to set their intentions. The new moon occurring on October 27. There it is. Okay. 
worth waiting for. Wow, this card has come up a lot. Divine timing is at work in your life. So some of you have been waiting, 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 waiting for something to happen. And now that change is coming. This energy of this, this Scorpio moon is going to change. The, the, you're going to have the, the ending of something, but something new is beginning that you're very passionate about. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. That's beautiful. Okay, consult an expert. Okay, more information is needed. Contact someone with expertise in this area. So whatever you're thinking about, uh, whatever uh, area in your life that was quite, that you had questions about, Spirit is saying consult an expert about, about it. Break free. Try different ventures and experiences as a way to grow and learn. This tells me that you need to go out and do things you haven't done, it before, done before and experience it with the, whoever this person is that you have passion with. Break free. That means not break free of the person. Break free trying new and different things. And that's maybe why you need to consult the expert. Because some things that you may want to try, okay, consult this expert so they can show you how to do it. And self-forgiveness. Let go of old guilt and remember that you're God's perfect child. So this saying is break, break free. Break free of any, any um, negativity that you had about yourself, anything you don't forgive yourself for. Break free of that as well. Explore your options. See, you got a lot of cards talking about, you know, looking at different things and doing different things. Energy healing work. This goes back to the self-forgiveness. Okay? Deal with it. Whatever's holding you back in emotionally, deal with it so you can move on. So you can have a good time exploring your options and consulting this expert about this, these new areas and these new territories that you're about to conquer. Because you just have to trust. Trust the process. Trust the process. All right, my Leos, if you want to do a private reading, information pertaining to that can be found below. Until next time, my loves. Bye-bye.